science is a vibrant field of study that covers almost all aspects of home, health and happiness of all members of the family, opens up excellent career opportunities, thus supports the development of the nation. I am Dr. Anjana Agarwal introducing the multitasking and life oriented subject home science at senior secondary level from NIOS. Many people still think that home science is confined to mastering the art of cooking and organizing household activities, but it is beyond that. It teaches the life skills and makes the foundation for future living. Hence, it is rightly thought to include home science at a school level. In the current scenario, both boys and girls and even challenged persons are coming together on the same platform in academics as well as in most professions. They share several household responsibilities and face physical, emotional, social and vocational challenges together. The syllabus of home science is a unique combination of art and science that you will learn during your learning. It has unfathomed depth of knowledge. You will have opportunities to master the skill of managing time, energy, money, material things, interiors and public facilities efficiently and live a smooth and satisfactory life. Its teaching in nutrition, cooking, food preservation, textile, human development and consumerism has the scientific approach. At the same time, it trains the learner to apply the subject knowledge and the skill for enrichment and professional development. This course has also touched some social issues such as gender bias, delinquent behavior, adolescents problem and relationships matter in family and at workplace. The beauty of home science course lies in its five components namely food and nutrition, resource management, clothing and textile, human development, extension and communication. This course of home science at senior secondary level from NIOS has five modules and two optional modules which are explained now. Module 1 is art and science of managing home. In this module you will understand the meaning and scope of home science, different types of families, code of ethics and how to protect the family members from physical hazards and social evils. This module is composed of three lessons namely home science, family health and security and ethics in daily life. Module 2 is food and nutrition that is composed of 6 lessons which are food, nutrition and health, meal planning, nutritional status, purchase and storage of food, preparation of foods, food preservation. The lesson 4 will provide the knowledge of 6 basic nutrients, their functions, the food sources necessary for good health and what can happen in case of deficiencies of these nutrients in the diet. In the next lesson you will learn to plan the balanced diet for different age groups according to nutritional requirements and other needs. The diet in pregnancy, lactation and also in certain diseases like fever, diabetes, heart disease etc. are also discussed in brief. There is a lesson on methods of assessment of nutritional status which also deals with the types, cause, consequences and preventive measures of malnutrition and some nutrient deficiency diseases. Lesson 7 discusses about the food spoilage and precautions need to be taken during purchase and storage of perishable, semi-perishable and non-perishable foods. Preparation of foods by different methods of cooking from boiling to baking and preservation of foods from dehydration to pickling are taught in lesson 8 and 9. Third module is resource management which includes 8 lessons namely family resource management, time and energy management, space management, 
income management, energy conservation, household equipment, environment management and consumer education. Family resource management teaches you about the best use of human and non-human resources and management process in organizing different events. In this module, you will also learn to manage your precious time, energy, money and environmental resources with examples from daily life. Your mind will be trained to become alert consumer and use household equipments and save energy in home, office and other places. Module 4 is human development in which you will learn about the growth and development in terms of physical, cognitive, social, emotional features in the age group of 0 to 5 years, 6 to 11 years, adolescence and old age. Various social and psychological concerns and issues in human development are also touched upon. Module 5 is textile and clothing. It teaches about the fabric science, construction of yarn, fabric and also about several textile finishes. In this module, you will understand the basics of textile that will help you to select appropriate textile material for different purposes and ways to launder and storage different fabrics like cotton, silk, wool, synthetics, etc. We also have two optional modules. Number one is housekeeping and number two is creative hand embroidery. You can choose one optional module in accordance with your own choice and need. These modules are related to vocational opportunities of which you can learn the basics here. Housekeeping module is very helpful in the field of housekeeping which has today taken up a big size in the market. In this you will learn about the care and maintenance of wood, glass, metals, etc. How to make different polishes for them, lesson on how to be a good housekeeper in various roles and duties and also how to maintain the different areas of premises are included. Aesthetics in home has focused on flower arrangement, floor decoration and ways to select, place and care other home articles using maximum utilization of space and articles. In one lesson, weightage is on repairing of simple household items and fixtures like electric fuse, plugs, plumbing to save time and money. Optional module on creative hand embroidery introduces the basics of hand embroidery, its tools and techniques in making various embroidery stitches. The module also suggests the ways to make designs, enlargement and reduction of motives, patterns and techniques to transfer the design on the fabric for embroidery. The section on colors has been discussed at length. After studying this subject at senior secondary level from NIOS, the learner become a dynamic person may intrigue in numerous aspects of human life. Thank you. You all are welcome to join this course now.